I'm moving into a house. <laughs> I am so grateful. I'm gonna miss this apartment. I'm 23 years old. Just turned 23 and I'm moving into a house. Good morning, y'all. It is 7.36 in the morning. It's really early. What today is? Today is April 12th. Um, I gotta turn my brightness down just a little bit. Look, 7.37. Welcome to my moving series. Now, it's a little bit chaotic and all over the place. So, I'm gonna explain everything a little bit later. Right now, I'm trying to head to Head Depot. Head Depot? Home Depot? Or Lowe's, but I think Head Depot, Head Depot, Home Depot is closer, so I might go there. Um, so a few things. We're moving into a house. Like I am so grateful, and I don't know if my car video is gonna come out before this or after this, or because I have so many videos I have to edit that I filmed. Like I don't know, but also a new car, same month, like. I am so beyond grateful. Like, it still feels like a dream. It does not feel real. Yesterday, we picked up the keys to the house. Um, we didn't start moving yet. We moved today. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to take you guys along with me. The house is literally so real. It's four bedrooms, two baths. It's so modern. I'm stationed in Fort Bliss. So, we're next to Mexico, basically. It's a lot of greenery. It's a whole bunch of rocks and all this good stuff. It's not a lot of modern homes. But... Where we live now is literally 30 minutes from here, where we currently live. Um, but it's newly built. Like the house we're moving into has only been built, uh, has been built two years ago. So that's that. So yeah, I'm about to head to Home Depot, and um, yeah, come with me. Oh, another thing, we have not packed. Um, at all, like zero things are packed, which means I'm gonna get boxes right now to pack to move. We get the U-Haul, well, we go to get the U-Haul at 9 a.m. It's 7.40, so bear with me. Um, and it's not, I'm not gonna say it's not, it's nobody's fault, but, like, everything happened so quickly. We toured the house. We toured multiple houses, but we toured the house. We found out that's the house we liked, that we wanted. We applied the very next day. The next day after that, we got approved. And yesterday, we went to go pick up the key. All of this happened in four days. I have never lived in a home, like, like myself that I got so I thought the process was gonna be super lengthy I didn't think that it would be like this the house is rented it's not bought we're not buying a house especially out here um, if if we do buy a house it'll be like we gotta have our areas whatever but we're building so that doesn't matter but yeah I'm about to um hit the home depot I've been talking so yeah let's go y'all Child. So we're in Target. I'm on like the moving area with boxes and tapes and stuff. I'm about to figure out what I need because I don't even know how many. I'm just gonna eyeball it. If I have to come back, I have to come back. So yeah, let's do this. baby girl my husband and then went to go get the u-haul he bought the boxes and stuff in from the car for me but oh hold on our address is on it um this is the little binder not binder but folder i'm covering up the address but this is the folder they gave us inside is like a whole bunch of numbers and stuff that we're supposed to call and it's like two or three pages so yeah i'm gonna get started on that and I think the first thing I'm going to pack up is either the kitchen or Samani's room. Um, so, yeah. And when I get back with the U-Haul, they're going to move, like, the big stuff in there. So, yeah. I'm excited, y'all. I cannot believe it. Like, I'm moving into a house. I'm 23 years old. Just turned 23, and I'm moving into a house. Make it make sense. A new house. A modern house. I can't believe it. I just cannot believe it, y'all. But that's 
where is she at that's baby girl excuse the living room but yeah so let's get started it's regarding your account yes ma'am Here's the baby. Say hi. So I'm moving to a new home today. So I leave in my first home. Yeah, I leave in my first home. It's kind of bittersweet, y'all, because she was made here. She was conceived here. She was brought home here. I was pregnant here. This was our first, oh shit, this was our first home together. Like, that's crazy. But, it's for the best. Speaking about that, we don't have to move out of this apartment till the 30th, the end of this month. So, we're not in no rush. I don't know if I already said that or not. But, yeah. Let me call, um, the other numbers and I'll get back with y'all. Cause it's gonna be a lot, so yeah. We just made it to the new house, me and Samani. This was my first time driving alone with her, so like nobody in the back seat, and it was hell, y'all. It was bad. I almost cried, but we're here because the locksmith people um said they're 15, 20 minutes away. Um, I'm gonna give you an empty house tour real quick before everybody gets here. Um, Jalen's on the way with the U-Haul. I know she was crying and choking and throwing up. The whole nine yards. My poor baby. But yeah. I won't ever be riding alone with her. I don't know when I'm going to be able to adjust to that. But I'm going to go in and show y'all the house real quick. But yeah, I'm going to give y'all a... Um, I'm going to give y'all an empty tour real quick. Bear with me because I have the baby. So y'all, for this question, I'll be doing a voiceover because I had some money, so I couldn't really talk and move. But that's the outside of the house. It is a four-bedroom, two bath with a garage. Um, this is the first room to my right. Um, just for my hair, it's like a guest room for us right now. And then next is the kitchen. Y'all, I love the kitchen. I love how it's modern, the little black um cabinets and the white cabinets. Like it's just really classy and elegant to me, in my opinion. But the, um, the layout of the house is really, really huge. So, like, this is the living room and dining area and, like, bar area. One of my favorite parts is the ceiling, that little black thing right there. That's so cute to me. Like, I really like that. But this is the hallway, um, the first hallway. This is the laundry room to my left. And then that connects to the garage. I really like how updated our washer and dryer is because in the apartment we had, like, an old one. But, yeah, this is the garage it's so big like i've never had a garage so like y'all this is just it just feels so good to me y'all then you go out of this room and it's two bedrooms here's the first one and that's the second one they're all about the same size uh bigger than the guest room though but these both are the same size same size closet and everything um then it's the storage closet outside of here and it's pretty spacious if you ask me but that's where all our luggage and stuff went but yeah, then this bathroom, y'all, this bathroom was super, super cute. Um, This is the guest bath. Um, then it has this little cutout in the roof. I'm going to show y'all. But like, it's like for natural light. There it go. Like, y'all, when I tell y'all, that's so cute. And it's like natural lighting. Look at me and Samani in the mirror. How cute. But I can't get over how tall these ceilings are, y'all. Like, it's super, super tall. So yeah, boom, back to the main floor pan. And then if you walk up, walk up, walk up, boom, this is the master bedroom, y'all. This is where it gets like real deal like our shit is huge like when i tell y'all it's huge and like the lighting is what did it for me like it's all white lighting like it's super cute this is the bathroom we got a his and hers going on let me turn on the light so y'all can see so yeah here's the his and hers the natural light and the natural white light too is so cute but yeah then we have a tub we have a walk-in shower i'm about to show that in a second and then y'all we have a shitter like <laughs> It's like an extra room. Like, I've never had a shitter with a door. So, that came in handy. Then this closet is literally amazing. Like, y'all don't understand how big this closet is. Like, it could be another room if we wanted it to be. Like, the size-wise. But, yeah. I just cannot get over the size of the closet. Like, it's just amazing. I'm truly blessed. But this is outside. Not too much on the backyard, y'all, but we have, like, this little covered pavement area. And then the rest of it is just dirt. 
our view is just dirt so y'all yeah, that is the house and like i can't believe it like i cannot believe it. this is real this is a dream come true i'm echoing i know i am so hopefully it doesn't sound bad on camera but i'm so blessed i'm so grateful like y'all just don't understand like it still feels like it's a dream like, it don't feel real like i'm truly blessed seriously Oh, my stomach's growling, but I'm waiting for the locksmith to come. She can change all the locks. And yeah, this is a four bedroom, two bath, with a two car garage. So yeah, that is the place, y'all. Hey, this is my new home. See, it's so modern and I love it. Yeah? I don't know, she got a little attitude right now. Because I had her sitting in the back by herself. I know I'm so sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna come back to y'all when we do something. Jalen should be here like in like 10 minutes. The locksmith said 20 minutes ish, so yeah. Look who's here, y'all. The U Haul. We got a big ass U Haul, y'all. Look. <laughs> Move the car? Let's see if he can do it or if you need me to spot him. Barely made it in, but should I have moved the car out? Like, okay. one, okay. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> okay, it started over. Hit the lock button. Now enter your four digits. There you go. Okay. So it is factory reset. Y'all, this is so chaotic. So the locksmith just left. Um, I got baby girl sleep on her tummy time mat and a blanket. I'm laying down too, obviously. Um, the guys are moving the stuff in. The guy who did our TVs at the other house, he's here now. And he's putting up all the TVs in all the rooms in the living room. And I'm just a girl, so I'm just laying here. Uh, I'm hungry, so I think we're gonna get something to eat. I know it's all over the place, but let me explain why. And I think I've touched on it if I didn't, sorry. But we toured this house. I wanna say that was what? I don't know, but we toured the house one day, right? It was like towards like six, seven o'clock, right? PM. The next day we apply the next morning. Well, afternoon, it was like 11. We got approved same day. And then we picked up the keys the very next day, paid the deposit, all the good stuff, and we're moving in today on the fourth day. So it was a four day process. We did not expect that it was gonna be this fast. So that's why like the packing wasn't done ahead of time. Everything is like same day, but I'm also not rushing because I think I already said this. Um, our apartment lease isn't up till the end of the month. So we have time. We're just moving like the major stuff. So yeah. Um, yeah. Just a baby. She's slumped. <laughs> and yeah, I'm up there child when something else happens. Talk to me nice, talk to me honestly Look in my eyes, don't let it fall on me Say you're a good guy, make me believe it Don't wanna hear it, I wanna see it See how, free one
I don't judge how I look, but it's May 1st. Fast forward, fast forward. Um, we've been moving out. We actually have another U-Haul right now. Today is the last day we're supposed to be in here. Well, it was midnight yesterday, so we turned in the keys this morning. So we're doing like all the final touches. Um, I walk you through what's, what's left, but it's bittersweet. I'm gonna put on my phone too, sorry. But it's bittersweet because she was conceived here. This was her first home. This was our first home as a marriage couple. Like, I don't know. It's sad, but it's, you know. But let me show you what's all left. It's the living room. It's empty. Uh, this was my baby's room, Samani's room. That's empty. Her clothes are on my mama. This was her bathroom. She's cranky. She don't feel good. So I'm sorry, y'all. Let me close this. Let me grab this one time. So yeah, this is the bathroom. That's the kitchen. I know, mommy. We're going to the doctor. This is the master's. Bathroom, closet, it's all empty, y'all, um, and it's so bittersweet, like, this was our first, like, and now we're in a house. Oh, baby, we got one more piece of trash up here. The bathroom, it was a handicap, y'all, so that's why it's like that. We don't have the his and hers. The closet, so yeah, that's pretty much everything. The patio is freaking done too. But yeah, baby girl is sick. She has a fever. She has an appointment in like 30 minutes. So we're rushing. So yeah. But I'll show you hard stuff. And um, yeah. I'm so sad, y'all. I'm gonna miss this apartment. We did good, though. We did good. Mamas, I know you're sick. We finna get you to the doctor. You got appointment in 30 minutes. Y'all, this it. Oh my goodness. That's broken. And I've been told him that was broke, so I had to fix that. That's not on me. But yeah, y'all. My dad, who's a maintenance man, just called him and I just showed him like the house. He said the only thing they might charge us for is that we didn't take no nails out of the wall and the mounts. But when we moved in, they told us it was okay for them for us to mount TVs, that they wouldn't charge us for that. So maybe just the nails in the wall, they'll still charge us for, but it shouldn't be that much, right? And then last thing is a hole in the wall from one of our dogs who used to eat the walls. But that shouldn't cost that much because when he did it before, we paid $25 out of our pocket. So, yeah. And our deposit was 1000 So, I think it was more than 1000 But, yeah. So, yeah, y'all. That's everything. This is the laundry room. If I didn't show it, it's empty. And that's it, y'all. We out of here. Say, say bye-bye. Yeah. Say bye. This goes in the trash. Oh, our first home. Yeah, y'all can see that just now. We don't live in the mo. That's the U-Haul, y'all. Oh, we did really good for our first time, y'all. But the house is done. That's trash too. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah. This the U-Haul, y'all. It's pretty much packed up. Like, to capacity. But that's it, y'all. I'm about to close it. So this is a long time later. Uh, excuse my beautiful pet. What today is? Today is Father's Day. We moved in April. So yeah. But this video is going up today. I forgot to make an outro. So I went to come in here and make an outro. Tell you guys that I love you guys. It should be a part two. I start with the house decorating, but it's kind of like weird a little bit because we never knew we were going to move that quick that soon. So I had actually bought a lot of stuff and I actually filmed me redecorating our apartment. And basically the whole thing just came into here, like all the designs and stuff like that just came into this house. But yeah, I don't know if y'all want to see that or if I can just like, I don't know, tweak it a little bit. I don't know, but yeah. But happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. And yeah, let me know if y'all want to see that part two, though, of me like designing and stuff like that. The house, I'm like putting stuff where it goes. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, also, I know I mentioned the car video in the beginning of this video. I'm sorry, but that's just not going to be a video in itself. She okay? 
So yeah, I'm sorry, but that's just not going to be a video in itself. It just, it didn't make the cut. It wasn't long enough, but we do have a new car. Um, and I'm very much so grateful for it. And yeah, I love you guys. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend to watch Living with Shaq. And yeah, bye guys.